We're going to do experiments using our rotating table. It's about a meter in diameter. And I'm going to roll balls down that little ramp. And when the table's not rotating, the ball will travel straight across. When the table rotates, the camera, which is affixed in the rotating frame, will see the Coriolis deflection of the ball. It deflects off to the right when I move the table in a right-handed sense. Now by hand I'm going to move it to the left and you'll see it's going to deflect the other way. Now we're going to use the motor on the table to rotate it at a constant rate. And what you'll see is the faster the table rotates, the more Coriolis deflection the ball feels. So at 4 RPM, you see the ball deflects a little bit. Now we'll increase the rotation rate to 8 RPM, and the ball will be deflected more. And it does. It's deflected about twice as much. Lastly, at 12 RPM, the ball's deflected even further to the right of its intended path. In a right-handed system that's rotating counterclockwise, the deflection of the particle is off to its right. Furthermore, we see that the strength of deflection increases with the rapidity of the rotation of the system.